We all heard the quotation by Mikio Kaku. I quote, science is a double-edged sword. One edge of the sword can cut against poverty, illness, disease, but the other could give us nuclear destruction, biogerms, and even forces of darkness. I unquote. But the question arises are, what is science? How has it been developed? And why is it so important? Is it good or harmful to us? To find out the answers of these questions, we must have to understand the history of ancient times. Early human beings were using stones and branches of trees to get their food from the trees and to protect themselves from animals. This started the invention of better and better tools. While using stones and tools, an ancient man probably rubbed them together which produced fire. This fire gave them warmth and also kept the wild animals away. From then, human beings learned how to ignite fire. Accidentally, a piece of meat fell into fire. When that piece of meat was taken out and eaten, it was tastier and easier to chew. In this way, early man learned cooking. In this process of learning, human beings started observing natural phenomena carefully and came out with some conclusion. This effort further led to new ideas and concepts. This organized human discovery is later on the given the name of science. So, science is defined as the systematic, ongoing efforts by human beings to study, understand and utilize the nature for meaningful purposes. This understanding is slowly developed by careful observation and experiments. Science is broadly classified into three main branches that is physics, chemistry and biology. The branch of science that deals with the study of composition and the physical and the chemical properties of various forms of matter is called chemistry. So, chemistry gives us the answer of our questions. What are the things made up of? How are they made up of? Will they remain the same form? Or can they be prepared by man? Development of chemistry Alchemy, an ancient practice, played an important role in the development and growth of chemistry. The goal of alchemy was to find a mythical and a magical substance called philosopher's stone with some magical power. Alchemy was both scientific and spiritual. In India, the alchemy was mainly practiced for medicines known as the Ayurvedic medicines. Importance of Chemistry Chemistry has played a vital role in the progress of mankind, directly or indirectly. All human activities depend upon the knowledge of chemistry. Everything from our food, cosmetics, medicines, soaps, detergents, textile, paper, etc. Let us discuss the application and uses of chemistry. Food and agriculture to increase the production of agriculture. We are using fertilizers like urea and potash. Pesticides like malathion and parathion. Insecticides like DDT and BHC. Fungicides like body X mixture and sulfur, etc. Minerals and petroleum. Petroleum products like petrol, diesel, kerosene, wax, etc. are separated from crude oil with the help of chemical processes. Industries. Industries are set up to produce a large number of products 
like dyes, paints, plastics, fibers, steel, alloys, and textiles, soap, detergents, etc. using the chemical processes. Medicines with the help of chemicals various medicines are developed like aspirin paracetamol antibiotics to increase the life span of human beings cosmetics talcum powder skin care creams lipsticks makeup deodorants baby products etc are used for external beautification of human body are also made with the help of chemical processes clothing chemistry is widely used in textile industries which manufactures clothes for us and converts fiber into fabric building materials basic raw materials such as cement mortar steel glass paint etc used for the construction of buildings are manufactured by chemical processes transport trains buses scooters ships cars and aeroplanes are product of chemical processes communication device synthetic chemical metallic wires and plastics used in telephones and mobile phones are all gifts of chemistry national defense substances like gunpowder tnt chemical weapons are all products of chemistry thus the progress of human race is dependent on chemistry it involves a lot of chemical research and unity in the industry dark side of chemistry the misuse of chemistry is also endangering the human society the harmful drugs like lsd cocaine brown sugar heroin etc are crumbling the human society deadly explosive like tnt rdx and atomic and hydrogen bombs are developed with the help of chemistry the causes of major pollution like polythene and styrofoam is the by product of chemistry thank you